Cameron, congratulations. First of all, how does it feel to get all that sorted? Um, yes, yeah, good pressure to, to be relieved and I feel happy and honoured to get a new contract and now I can just kick on for the rest of the season and the next few years. Because it's been a big couple of weeks for you, going away with the first team in pre-season, a real taste of it. Yeah, th I think that was a very good experience. I felt I learned a lot about myself and about the first team environment, what you have to do to be up there on a consistent basis. So that was a really good experience. And I think I've took what I've learned from there to the 23s again and time to push on in my season with them and see how far we go. Did it help that there was a group of you that were in amongst you, that you weren't just suddenly thrown into it on your own? Uh, I think that was a good help. I think being with lads that I played with for the whole of last year kind of helped me fit in a bit more. And as there was a group of, group of us, we could all learn and grow together in that environment. So, yeah, it was a good help. Because I guess as well, when you look at the first team squad, there's a lot of young guys in that squad. There's players who've obviously played a lot of games, but they're not that dissimilar to you in age. Yeah, I think that gives all of us a good belief, especially myself, that the squad's quite young and seeing the likes of Morgan and Bright all push through and them being similar ages to myself. So seeing that was great like belief for me to believe that I can make make the jump and make a chance in the first team. Are they the real inspirations? I I'd say they, they are a key one, yes. I'd say, especially in my position, I'd say Courtney's another one that kind of look up to and Danny and Coates and how they helped me on that trip as well and the advice and little tips and pointers they gave me about my game and what I can add really helped me and I, hopefully I can take that in and uh, use it in my season. Because how important is it to have those role models, those people around the place that you can have those little conversations with? Yes, yeah, it's, it's massive. I think every conversation you have with them, you always learn a little bit extra, something new and they always give you a good point of view from like the playing side or even off the pitch and they always help you in any part of life. So yeah, it's been great help. So I remember talking to you when you first came into the club, <laughs> not that long ago. No, nah, not long. When you came in from South End. Yeah. Are you different? What have you, what's changed about you in the last couple of years? Um, I'd say I've got a lot more confident. I think back then I was a bit shy and coming to a new place, coming to a new environment. I wasn't really sure how I would fit in, but I think over the years I've learned about the club, the culture and what you have to do to be at this club. And I think I've just learned about the Wolves way and how to be in and around the people, the place. And I think I've just learned a lot. I've matured quite a lot as well, coming from a young age and being able to mature by myself and learn about myself personally and what I can deal with and what I can then do for my goals, so it's been really good. Yeah, I guess that sense of belonging. Yeah, I feel like I belong here now and I feel like now I can just kick on and keep trying to prove myself to every coach that I, I'm good enough to be here. Because that's the key thing, isn't it? Kicking on, you've got a couple of years now, you've had a little taste, as we say, in pre-season. It's now, over these next few years, really pushing yourself to get in. Yeah, definitely. I think the goal for me is to show the gaffer and show everyone that I can play first team football and the club being in the Premier League now, that's a bigger incentive and I just want to keep trying to push and prove that I can play at the highest level and help the club like, improve in the future.